me and my mom. And today we're gonna um today my mom is a school teacher. So we're gonna make a video for her and we are making book guys today. Oh H. Oh H. Okay, so what do we have to do before we cook? Wash your hands. Are your hands washed? No. Okay, say so we'll be right back. We'll be right back. Gonna wash hands. Gonna wash hands. We're back. We're done washing our hands. Clean hands. Clean hands. And we're gonna make a book eyes now. Woo, woo. We're gonna make book eyes. And what do we need when we're gonna cook? Um, that's, the, we have our ingredients out over But how do we know what ingredients we need? Mommy has her fan on her phone. What thing am I going to pull up? What's it called? Um, it is, she has a picture. But what is it? It's, Ooh, a, it. it's a menu. Nope, not a menu. Um, a recipe. Yep, we've got a recipe, recipe. to follow on the phone. So, we need peanut butter first. Peanut butter! We're going to get our hands all peanut butter, correct, Mom? I hope not. <laughs> don't want to make this if you have peanut allergies. I don't have... So, guys, are you guys have, like... Are you guys still like peanut butter or then don't make buckets? Amen. If you don't like peanut butter, then don't make buckets. So, guys, we have, like, this machine that can, like, twirl our so fast. Do not go to number 10 if you have one of these. Please don't. What and happened last night when you did that, when we were making cookies? Cause it flowed everywhere. <laughs> it could spoil it everywhere. I, okay. went, I went to number four, but then... Yeah, you didn't even make it to ten, and it exploded everywhere. <laughs> All right, so I've got some peanut good butter. old fashioned Jif peanut butter here. Jif? Jif, Jif. Jif. we're gonna use a cup and a half of it. A cup? I know, but to make it so we don't have to wash a whole bunch of dishes in between, we're gonna use a half a cup. Let's so see if the guys, boys are listening. Hey boys, are you listening? Yeah. If I'm using a half a cup and I'm doing a cup and a half, how many half cups do I need? Uh, four. Oh my gosh, my kids can't do measurements. Four. If I need a cup and a half of peanut butter and I'm using a half, uh, oh, thank goodness. My fifth grader finally can do some measurements. Three. Yes, mm -hmm. we need three scoops of peanut butter. One scoop. So, we have one scoop that's already. one scoop. Two. Notice that I'm using my rubber spatula. See, she, you, you can buy, and it's purple. It's purple. That's her favorite color. Mm -hmm. Well, I have like these green socks on. <laughs> Isn't that appetizing? <laughs> Probably not meeting safety standards if you have your feet right next to the bowl. Just to <laughs> as we review some key things from basic foods, that's what this is going to be for. So tomorrow we're going to make like a lot of videos, but... Yeah, what else are we cooking this week? Do you remember what I told you when we're getting um, ingredients for it? That's number two. What else are we making this week? Um, sugar cookies. We're making sugar cookies because see what happened is... The school went virtual because of Coronav the coronavirus. Virus. And so, so we're going to make videos at home and show the kids what we were supposed to cook in class. So then they can make it at home. So guys, if you guys are watching this right now, then you're allowed to bake with us. If you want to make Buckeyes with us, that's fine with us. Yeah, these are the best Buckeyes and they're super easy. To make because that's how we cook easy peasy lemon squeezy free we are free and doing and mix it up nope not yet that's number three though you're right we don't need any more peanut butter lift it up so i can wipe all right all right peanut butter is sure. in no we're not stirring yet i gotta get the recipe my phone locked <laughs> out so we have one and a half cups of peanut butter i need one cup of butter where are my measurement boys wesley yeah i need one <laughs> cup of butter so that equals but one. a stick of butter is a half a cup. So how many yeah. sticks am I putting in? Two. Oh, that was good. Even Jessica, the kindergartner, knows. <laughs> so each stick is a half a cup. Boom. We're gonna put two Boom. in because we need one Let's cup of butter. Guys, if you guys taste butter, 
Ew, Butter by itself is pretty disgusting. Um, All right, and then we need a half a teaspoon Bob, of vanilla. you guys vanilla. want to smell my hand? If they only had smell-o-vision. Oh, I already had a rubber spatula here. I was prepared. <laughs> half a teaspoon. Mom, you have one right here. That's not a half a teaspoon. Silly. Hey, look, my measuring spoons are in the shape of a heart. Yeah, I love hearts, but I don't know. I see this. That's how you make a heart? That's good. You you do a good job at drawing hearts. So we're going to do a half a teaspoon of vanilla. And you want to so know... So today when I was at church, um, I made a pa piece of paper that was white. And I, we stick them... Do you know that? Do you know we have like Jesus and like the girl and with Jesus and the girl? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the, we put it our stars up and stuff. And, oh, then, and then I wanted to put my piece of paper up. Oh, that's a good so idea. She, so um, she, I was going to point out, can I just real quick interrupt your story? And I was going to say, make sure you don't measure over the bowl when I was measuring my vanilla. So guys, do you want to see like the front of it or so? Well, right now we're just mixing. Uh, the butter and the peanut butter. Should we, should we give them a view of it? Yeah. Guys, we're going to get to a view of it. Oh, there it is. There it is. We've got to mix it until Mom, there's... Mom, what should be the number? Oh, the number? I don't know if my hand can move that way. There it is. Yeah, and so this is here. So do you see the black thing right here? Yep, so you can go up a little bit more. Because what we're trying to do is get those clumps of butter out. Yeah. So go ahead and move it up a little bit. Can you take it up to six? Whoa! All right, I'm going to put it back here. Dad, I want you to get that thing. We don't want you to get any peanut butter on you. Okay. <laughs> it's not bad. <laughs> and it's still going. If you want to hold this? Don't lick it. <laughs> we know that would be a big food safety no-no. <laughs> watch they don't know about you they don't know about the name yeah they don't know that you so, have a, a youtube channel and that you have a blog they don't so know that guys i have a blog here i'm gonna measure we need six of these you can talk about little seal so we have little seal in a big world that's what my um channel is called mm -hmm. yep your so, show it's your show oh wait we made four videos already. Yeah, this is video number four. So guys, That's we made like one. three videos already, but now it's number four for this video. Yep. This is our four videos. There's number two. Well, I hope we get a, like a ten video. Number three. So guys, like, um, so my mom has a class. Mm -hmm. I do. And she works at the Edison. Number four. She works at the Edison High School. Yeah. And here's my mom. Ah, I just made a mess. Mm -hmm. Number five. He's my and mom. And now I'm kind of breaking my rule of measuring over the bowl, but. That's okay. Yeah, don't tell my students. Oops, it's for them. Number six. Okay, now if you remember Wait. that. 
So my brothers are here, but the, but dad, but my dad said to keep it quiet because we're doing a video. Exactly. Now and I'm gonna turn this on. And what was our rule when we go to turn it on? And there's a bunch of powder in there. What do we, we do? Have, we have to turn it to one, and then we're allowed to go to turn it on. Yeah, because we don't want it to poof out. <laughs> Now, what should, what do you think people Wait, could do if they don't have a KitchenAid mixer at home? So if they that, don't have a cool KitchenAid mixer like us? Do you guys have a KitchenAid mixer? Do you guys still have a KitchenAid mixer? You guys are allowed to buy one. Well, that's kind of expensive. So what else could they do? Um, you guys can use a bowl. How else could oh, you? Oh, I know, I know. You could get a bowl and then like, um, you have like a blender. You could use that to the, blend it. A handheld electric mixer you could do that but it's really thick dough do you know how I like to mix it if I don't have a mixer with my clean hands it's not disgusting here we're gonna show you what the Buckeyes look like in there now see the dough coming all together you can see oh now you can turn it up because there's nothing that's gonna poof out of there And now, now you don't get to eat the dough. These aren't yours. Um, we're gonna take. I'm gonna no, no. Your hands are clean, but you're not gonna use them to eat your your peanut butter. What's gonna happen now? Oh, you know what? Just to make sure we have them all the same size. We are going. So guys, I have like a lot of videos on my phone. That's why we're using my mom's. Nope, you're using your dad's phone. My dad. Okay, so we're going to use a cookie scoop so that our yeah, Buckeyes can you, can you show them so it? that our Buckeyes are all the same size like our cookie scoops we use in the classroom. And then you're going to take it out. <laughs> you totally could eat this because it doesn't have to be cooked. It's butter, vanilla, peanut butter, and powdered sugar. So it's all edible, but we have to freeze it so we can dip it in chocolate. So you're gonna take that, you're gonna line them in a, put them in a pan that is lined with wax paper, and you're gonna shove a toothpick in each one, Ew. and put it in the freezer for a couple hours. And then we'll be back. All right, just tell them, see ya in a little bit. No, wait, can we show, can we show them when we put our toothpicks in? We will, we'll come back. Okay, we guys, we They don't have to watch all of this. This is gonna take forever. Okay, They have bye better guys. things to do. Bye. All right, bye guys, we'll see wait, you soon. Wait, 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 uh, um, remember, Check my page and subscribe to my video. I'll see you in a couple of minutes. That's my Jess. Hey guys, now it's time to do a toothpicks. And here's our batch for all. I'm trying to get like Yep, that. yep, push it all the way in. Because what this is going to do is when we go to dip them. Whoa, sorry guys. When we go to dip them in the chocolate. Oh, now I get a show you to do. So this is gonna be like chocolate. Yeah. And then we like. Hey guys, now it's time to do toothpicks. Let's put it in. So now it's like a lollipop when you eat them. They're gonna. Nope. So this we take those out at the very end. Uh, should we take that? Out? She has no clue what a buckeye is. Sorry. Wait. Now I get it. So you put a hole through. Like a big hole. No, there's no hole. I'm kind of embarrassed. You really don't know what a buckeye is? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So it's a circle. It's a sphere. Remember, you're sphere. learning your shapes? Yeah, sphere. Okay, so what you're going to do is you want to make sure you put the buckeye, the toothpicks in, put them in good and all the way through. And you can see that recipe makes a lot of buckeyes. And then we're going to put them in the freezer. Yep, you got it. We're going to put them in the freezer for a couple of hours. When it freezes... I want to keep it in for like to count to 100. I think I'm allowed to count to 100 and then they're allowed to count. They need to go a lot longer than 100. Um, because what's going to happen is the peanut butter balls will freeze to the stick and it'll be able to be dipped into the semi-sweet chocolate. Um, in order to there's get the so outer. Much, there's so, so much of these. Yeah, we made a lot. I don't know why did we We're gonna give them to the teachers at school tomorrow. You think they're gonna love them? Yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yeah, they're going to love the Buckeyes. Can we, can we eat those? I think maybe you can try one. We'll call it quality assurance. Oh, yeah. We're, yeah. Quality let's, control. Yeah, let's, 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 so everybody in this house is going to have one. That's it. That's okay. That sounds like a plan. Yeah. Okay, so you keep pushing it in. So we're going to put the toothpicks in, all of them. Then we're going to freeze it. And then we'll come back in a little bit, maybe before bedtime, um, maybe not until tomorrow, and then they won't get Buckeyes until Tuesday. We'll see. Um, but you are going to, when they're frozen, dip them into chocolate, and then you remove the toothpick and cover the hole. And we'll show you how we do that later on. You're doing good. Okay, I think they get the gist of that. You want to say we'll see you in a little bit? No. Yeah, let's see you in a little bit. All right, we'll be back. See ya. Can I still put the toothpicks in? Yeah. Hey guys, we're gonna. It's me and my mom again. So remember about um these. What are they? They are buckeyes. Remember about our buckeyes? Look, they're like lollipops. So we have our chocolate in there. So, I brushed my teeth already. <laughs> but, Mom, what after... What brushing your teeth have to do with making buckets? Well, after, well, after when I'm done, mm -hmm. I'm going to brush my teeth again. When, when I eat this, I'm going to brush my teeth. Hey, I don't think we ever finished that later on, we're going to be making two more recipes this week. Oh, we, we're going to make two recipes this week. Oh, my chocolate's still not melted, so we've got to um, go. Yeah. So, Mom, juggle the chocolate. Okay, yeah, that's a good idea. Thanks. <laughs> you must, like, be a blogger or something. It's really hot. But, okay, so here's the chocolate. Ah! Those are our semi-sweet Nestle <laughs> milk chocolate chips morsels. And we are melting them in the microwave. Um... My plan when I melt love you, pop. Love chocolate love you, pop. is what letter does that start with? Oh, mom, my babies are learning about um, my babies are learning about B today. Oh. It starts with B, 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 B guys. Yeah, good it job. Starts with B. My babies are learning B. That's really cool. Um, <laughs> but when I'm melting the chocolate, we do like 30 to 45 seconds and stir. And then go 30 to 45 seconds again and stir. If you just microwave, the morsels are made to keep their shape. They're not. <laughs> um, so just like if you make a chocolate chip cookie, how the, the morsel stays the right shape. If you're just melting them in the microwave and never stirring them, they're going to keep their shape. So you have to stir or else you'll end up burning your chocolate. So guys, if you guys have like that. So if you guys have like a in your refrigerator, you have, to put, you have to put these in here for like a... How long do you think we froze them for? A couple hours? Like a couple of hours. Long enough to cook dinner and eat dinner. So after dinner, we got these guys out. So oh, I've got chocolate ready. Let me get it smooth. It's so, so this is where my mom put it on right here. Up oh, they just see a floating head, but yes. So, my am putting a thumb right here. So. That works. And. Oh, yeah. um, um, give me a from that. Give me a Okay, you jump and I'll push. Real. Oh. Okay. All right, so this is what we're using. Milk, chocolate, and it, it just seems to work best if you do Nestle. You can buy generic, but they don't have the best quality. So. One time I tried to use Hershey Kisses because we were out. It doesn't work. Don't do that. If you want to go simple, not the best chocolate quality, but it's a little bit easier, you can get um, this chocolate here. It comes in a tray. You just microwave it by the directions on the box in the tray, and it's a lot less messy and easy to do. But we're going to go with the Nestle Semi-Sweet. If you guys are doing this with us, that's all right with us. Just follow our lead. Yeah. Here we go. We've Same. got Buckeyes. Look at this. Woo! Can I get Woo! this one in? It's a Buckeye. Can I get this one in? We're only going to do a half a pan for the video because we have a lot of Buckeyes. That recipe. Now, that's kind of a wimpy Buckeye. 
We wanna make sure we get the right proportion to chocolate to peanut butter. And you'll see that it truly looks like a Buckeye. It's so cool. Doesn't that look like a Buckeye? Remember when we picked them out of Papa's yard? Yes. Oh, okay. Yep, you kind of twirl it around. This one? Okay, um, like try to get it up a little bit higher. Like this? Yep, dip it in there some more. And you kind of swirl around. So, and can I know you guys can't really so, see the bowl. Maybe I'll hold can, the phone and do it. No, 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 leave it down. So, we'll be back in a little bit to show them what the end product looks like. Here, let's, yeah. let's show them a, a, a good dip, though. Grab one and dip it. So, uh, nope, grab the toothpick. Here we go. And in the bowl. Dip and swirl. And then you kind of want to take a spoon and get that extra off the bottom. Although I think I'm making it worse. Where'd the bucket? There. Okay, and then we're gonna put it back on the wax paper in the pan without making too big of a drop. There we go. Okay, and we'll see you back in a little bit. We got yeah. a lot of Buckeyes to dip, and we'll see you soon. Bye. Hey guys, you guys can see the antlers. She's growing antlers. That's how long these Buckeyes are taking to make. Okay, so we're back. All of our Buckeyes have been dipped. Some are really good looking, and some aren't so much. Because some of them lost. The toothpick slides out sometimes, so you've got to be careful that the toothpick doesn't get stuck in so, the buckeye. Here, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the phone so here. This one, this one, it got the. Yep, we we pulled the toothpick out because it was starting to slip out, and we didn't want it to and... come out. Now, once all of your buckeyes have been dipped, this is our second pan here. You need to go through and remove the toothpick. Now, I always joke, oh, good job, yep, good job. Make sure the whole toothpick comes out. I always joke that, oh, don't touch the chocolate. Nope, now you gotta go wash your hands. No licking the fingers, that's so tempting. But um, I joke that when you leave the, the holes there, those are tacky Buckeyes is what I would teach you in class if we were actually gonna be in class this week. So if you just take your finger really ever so slightly, you can cover the holes and have true Buckeyes. See how much better that looks? So much better. So we're gonna go do that for all of our Buckeyes and we'll be back for the big tasting reveal in just a little bit. See ya. Hi guys, now it's time to test out this Buckeye. They're all done, all the hard work. Unfortunately, this is the part you guys don't get to enjoy this week in school. You guys would have several to enjoy. Go ahead, you can try it. Mmm. Mmm, yes. You approve? Okay, what do you say at the end of your show? Subscribe, like my page. Subscribe and like your page. And what's the name of your page? What's the name of your show? Um. Little Santa Bigra. Say it nice and clear for them. After you Little eat. Little Santa and a big world. And how do you spell seal? They should know because I'm a teacher and that's my name. But they don't. S E L. No. S E E L. S E E L. Little okay. seal in a big world. That's you. And this has been Getting Messy with Jesse. I got my fingers. Just lick it. Now you can lick. <laughs>